Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Chris or X guys and today I'm going to show you a new way to get perkaholic in black ops 4 zombies With this new method you can get up to 10 perks in total It works on any single map in black ops 4 zombies as well as solo co-op and all of that good stuff So without further ado, I'm going to show you what you need to do to set up your game so before you load into your game, you can do any map. There is one very important thing, and you do need the secret sauce perk on one of your slots. It doesn't matter which slot, which perk area. It does not matter. You don't need any talismans, anything like that. But you do need secret sauce. So make sure that you throw on secret sauce, and then you can go ahead and load into your game. Once you are loaded in, you're going to want to head on over to that secret sauce perk machine. Depending on where it's at, it's different depending on where you put it in your slot. But head on up to the perk machine and what you're going to want to do in a very fast motion is hold square to purchase the perk immediately knife and it's going to drop the perk bottle and you want to hold square again and as you guys can see here it's going to give me the time slip perk bottle but it's clearly not one of the four perks that you guys can see on screen what's happening here is there is an off screen indicator for five hidden perks that you can get and you can't like actually see the perk or anything but you can use the perk and you do have the effect it's very easy to show you guys this with mule kick which i will be getting in this video so you can see exactly what i mean but for now i'm going to put the perk on the bottom left that i just got which is time slip on the bottom of the screen and i'm going to continue on with this so you can continue to do this up to five times. Here's the second time that I do it. And as you can see, I got time slip and I also got stronghold as well. So here's the second time and it gives me the perk bottle for bandolier bandit. So my ammo count is going to immediately increase. You can see it jumps up to 80, which is the bandolier bandit effect. So you can see like the perks are working. You are getting extra perks here. I get electric cherry and then I actually end up getting it twice because it is my first perk slot. But here is where you can really tell that this works. So mule kick, I just got the mule kick perk as my fourth hidden perk so i can go and purchase guns and you guys can see like i have the the starting revolver and then i just bought the mog and i'm going to go down here and buy the three round burst pistol and i can switch between all three weapons now those perks in the bottom left right next to my points like time slip manual electric cherry mule kick you don't see this in game that's all photoshopped into this video but i do have the mule kick perk and you can do this up to five times now what you want to be aware of is you can only do this five times and once you do it the fifth time you're going to notice in the bottom right on your perk modifier it's going to light up a color that's how you know that you have purchased all the perks and then you have your modifier effect active as well so that's how you guys can see like i've only bought one perk in game and I can go around and buy the other perks, but I have the modifier already for buying the four perks. You can go around the map, you can buy your perks normally, and you can get up to a total of nine perks or ten perks in total if you count like double tap, speed call, and all that from buying like all the perks, like the perma perk effects and all that. But this is super, super easy to do. It's very easy. You can do it solo, co op, doesn't matter. Just be very careful when you do this because if you continue to buy perks, it's going to crash your game. You can only do this up to that five times. You can do it like a couple more if you end up getting duplicate perks because you can get duplicates. But just be super careful with this. Don't go crazy because your game will eventually crash. Another thing, if you're playing online and you get to the step where you get like the fifth perk for free from doing the challenges, don't pick that up because that will also crash your game. So you just want to be very, very careful. But you can do this very easy to do and it's very helpful on easter eggs anything like that high rounds you can have up to nine perks in any of the zombies maps thank you guys so much for watching this video make sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new there's gonna be a ton of black ops 4 zombies content coming very soon thank you guys again so so much for watching this video until next time i'll see you guys later with some more black ops 4 zombies peace